Squeeze is full of tools to make your video look and sound better. Filters are one such tool. A few of the default filters can be found in the window just below your presets. These default filters include popular filters like deinterlacing, watermark, timecode, but there are many more to choose from. To apply one of these default filters, simply click the filter you want to apply and drag and drop it onto your job. You can add filters before or after you have applied your video. To view the effect of your filter after you've applied it to your video, you can do so in the preview window. This shows what your video will look like before and after the filter is applied. You can drag the AB slider from side to side to see the effects of the filter on different parts of your video. On the left or A side is the video after the filters have been applied, and on the right or B side is what it looked like before. You can apply multiple filters to the same video. To take advantage of the many other filters in Squeeze, simply double click on the filter that we've already applied. Select any of the filters that you wish, and you'll again see the effect instantly applied to your video. Click the down arrow on any of the filters, and that will allow you to make adjustments to that specific filter. You can also create your own custom filters in Squeeze to get exactly the effect that you want. To create a new custom filter, just click on the plus icon at the bottom of the filters window. Let's create a filter to change the gamma and the brightness for our videos. Once we have the settings where we want them, we can simply give the filter a name and save it for future use. Our filter is now ready to go whenever we want to use it again. Filters are one of the features that really make Squeeze stand out, and a great way to enhance your video projects and take them to the next level.